Hello, what's up, guys? In this video, I'm going to show you how to create this exact same t shirt design that you see on the screen right now using Adobe Illustrator. So, without any further delay, let's start it. Now, at first, I just simply open up Illustrator and go to File, New, and then set with 4500 pixels and set height. 400 pixels and choose color mode RGB and to create a new artboard I just simply hit on create and this time we add text in our artboard to do this from the left side simply select type tool and click on this artboard to increase the size of your font from this drop down menu choose a menu choose any of your preferred font size but this time I just simply type 500 pixels and hit on enter. Now I remove this text and this time I type legends. And to add another text block, I just simply navigate to the selection tool and select this type tool again and this time I type R. And again to create another text block, I just simply navigate to the selection tool and click on this type tool and after that click on this artboard and this time I type born in and I navigate to the selection tool again and select type tool and click on this artboard and finally this time I type a month let's type June all right now if you want to change this font style then simply select any of your text doc and from this drop down menu choose any of these. This time I use a special font which is called NCAA Michigan font. Now I just click on this font style. Alright, you will get this special font download link in this YouTube video description so don't worry about that. And for this text block R I just select the same font and for this other two text blocks I just choose the same one all right now I navigate to the selection tool and holding shift and dragging on this corner I just simply make this text block bigger now I simply set it in middle and then I select this text block R and increase this size a little bit more and then set it here and increase the size a little bit on in and finally I select this June text block and holding shift and dragging on this corner I just simply make this text block bigger Now I select every text box and then click on this little icon horizontal align center. Excellent. We just successfully add text in our artboard. Now I just open up browser and search for arrow shapes. Now I go to the image tab and this time I download this arrow shape. I just simply hit on view image and right click on it, click on save image as and set destination folder desktop and hit on save. Alright, now in illustrator I just simply go to file, open and select this arrow shape and hit on open. To make this image as a vector file without this white background. I just simply select this one and click on image stress and click on expand and after that I just simply choose this direct selection tool and click on this blank space and click on this white background and press delete and again I just simply click on this white background and press delete again now I just simply select this arrow shape and press Ctrl C to copy it. 
and after that I just simply navigate to this artboard and paste it here by simply pressing Ctrl V. Alright, now I navigate to the selection tool and set this arrow right here. Now to copy this arrow shape, I just simply press Alter and click and drag it to the right. And after that I just simply right click on it and go to transform and select reflect and choose vertical and hit on ok. Now I just simply set it here. Alright, now if you want to change this arrow color, simply select any of your preferred arrow and from swatches, I just choose fill and set color red. And again I choose this another arrow and set color in red. And now I just draw a another shape. To do this I just simply select this rectangle tool and draw a rectangle. Like this. And now I go to object, envelope distort and select make with warp. Now from this drop down menu here we see different type of shapes are available. But this time I choose this squeezy shape. And now I decrease the value of this blend. And now I am satisfied with that. And that's why I just hit on OK. And now I navigate to the selection tool. And simply set it. Set the shape in middle. And then I just simply right click on it. Arrange and select send to back and holding shift and dragging on this corner I just simply make this shape bigger and then set it right here. Now I just simply select this text block legends and then go to object envelope and resort and select make with warp. Now from this style I choose style arc and then set blend mode in 25% and after that I just simply hit on ok alright now from the left side I just simply click and hold on this icon and select start tool now now holding shift and dragging on this artboard I just draw a star and from swatches I change color from gray to black. Now using the selection tool, I just simply set it here and decrease the size a little bit. And after that, I just simply press Alter and click and drag it to the right to copy it. And again, I just select this one and holding Alter and drag it to the right to copy it again. And this time, for this middle star, from swatches I set color in red. So our designing is complete. Now this time we just export our design with transparent background. To do this, I just simply go to File, Export and select Save for web or select export as. This time I choose export as. And then I choose my destination folder desktop and hit on export. And from this PNG options, I choose resolution 300 ppi. And background color. From this drop down menu, I choose transparent. And now I finally hit on OK. So our exporting is done complete and here it is. Our t-shirt design with transparent background. Now you can easily upload this design anywhere you want. Like Tree Spring, Mud by Amazon Redbubble and some of other print on demand t-shirt design companies. So using these techniques and use your creativity, hopefully you will able to create much more amazing t-shirts like this one. Recently, I published a course which is called Best Selling T-Shirt Design Mastery with Adobe Illustrator where I practically teach how I create my best selling t-shirts with Adobe Illustrator software. Also, I share some super cool tricks to create awesome hot selling t-shirts in a very short time. 
regular price of this course is $190. But for my YouTube viewers, I am offering this course only in $10. A special offer link is given in the description below. So just go ahead and check this.